Welcome to this video on Two's Complement. This learning video will enable you to define Two's Complement and identify the bit pattern in Two's Complement. In the previous video, we learned about the Ones Complement. In this video, we will learn about the Two's Complement notation which builds on the Ones Complement notation. Let us look at the steps to get a two's complement of a given number. To do that, we need to compute the one's complement and then we need to add one to the result to arrive at the two's complement of the given number. The two's complement notation has the following advantages. The sign of the number can be computed by looking at the most significant bit. It is easy to add two numbers. The addition operation can be used to perform subtraction. There is only one bit pattern to represent zero, so an extra number can be represented. The table shown summarizes the two's complement notation for a four bit number. Consider the following operation of adding two's complement of seven with the two's complement of minus two. Substituting the bit patterns from the table, we get 0 1 1 1 for plus 7 and 1 1 1 0 for minus 2. The bit pattern 0 1 0 1 is 5 with a carryover of 1, which is the expected result. The only drawback with the 2's complement notation is that the bit patterns are not in order. That is, comparing the bit patterns alone does not provide any information as to which number is larger. Key points discussed in this video. To get a two's complement of a number, you need to compute the one's complement and then add one to the result to arrive at the two's complement. The two's complement notation builds on the one's complement notation. The sign of the number can be computed by looking at the most significant bit. 